what's going on guys welcome back into some more no 1800 all right you may have to excuse my voice today um i got like a head cold or something i i feel terrible i sound terrible but you know we're gonna get through this together um, a couple of people have mentioned lately that my voice sounds like it is peaking on the audio i am trying to adjust that and fix it i am no audio engineer i have zero clue what i'm doing with all these settings and i'm basically relying on the good old google foo of best obs settings with a blue yeti and trying stuff so i, I have no idea what i'm doing with the audio uh if you are really good with audio stuff hop over on discord and you know let me know what i might be doing wrong with my audio i, I don't know I i'm not a pro here i'm just a guy playing video games that spends way too much money on stuff that he doesn't know how to use anyways let's jump into the game here uh so we have gotten up to engineers of course here on crown falls in the old world and things are going pretty good. We do have a, a bit of an extra balance right now uh, because we are supplying beer, which we normally would not be supplying to our uh, artisans and workers uh, because I'm not producing that. So we're getting a little bit of inflation on our balance, but that's perfectly okay. I'm not worried about it. We are making a ton of money, as you well know, from the sale of all of our weapons and steam motors. You can see right here, we're just making an absolute butt ton of money off of selling those things. If you are not familiar with how I'm doing that, be sure to check out the video I put out recently about how you can make uh, 16K or more every couple of minutes in coins. That video is going to be popping up in the upper right corner and it will be down in the description. So check that out if you wanna know how to make some easy tons of cash early game. All right, so today's focus is actually going to be away from Crown Falls just for right now. We're going to pop over to Manola here in the New World and get started on this place over here. Um, I do want to go ahead and grab a couple of things. Uh, I would like another clipper. Let's send that up there. I want two clippers. And actually, I do want to go over here real quick. I have a clipper here. Yeah, I've got a frigate and my flagship here. I would like to have a couple of frigates in the new world, but we don't have any frigates for sale at the moment. That is that is okay. I think what I might do at some point is make weapons and make our own frigates for a little while. Um, you know what? Let's just go ahead and do that now while I'm thinking about it. Let's just make that. Let's just make that happen. Let's just get another furnace going right here. And a weapons factory. Let's see, where do I want it at actually? I have to, you know me, I've gotta have it. It's gotta be in a, in a good place. It's gotta look, it's gotta look decent. Can't be anywhere curry gray. It's gotta be somewhere nice. We'll put him right here. And then I'm going to move you right there with it, which means I want to move this somewhere else. Okay. Let's do this. Let's move these guys around. We'll put him over here so I can move him up to here. Drag me another road there and there. And we'll also go ahead and just move you for now anyways. Like prison, yeah. yeah, I'm sure it's like a prison. Okay, so that's going to be our weapons factory. We're just going to let it run, you know, normally. Nothing nothing crazy with it. Uh, we are good on coal and iron, so I don't have to worry about that. The uh, beer festival lasts for another 20 minutes, and then we will be able to see what our actual income is. But at least we'll be able to start making our own weapons. I am going to preemptively tell this that I want to sell some uh, 30 and 30, 20 and 15. So if I sell, tell it to sell anything over 30, I think we'll be okay. So we'll just actually, we'll sell anything over 50 on the weapons. That way, if I get a quest where they want some, uh, where like, you know, maybe the pirate or something when I become friends with the pirates. Uh, if they want a little bit 
I can give them some weapons because sometimes they do ask for that. And you can sell weapons to uh, what's her face down here. Yeah, you can sell weapons to her for 912 each. So a decent little way to make cash. All right. Rambling out of the way, let's get Manoa built. Now, I think I'm going to build Manoa a little, a little tighter than normal. We're going to go like this. All right, we'll go like start with that with it, I think. Got plenty of wood, so I'm actually going to just go ahead and come way out over here near where to the clay deposit is that I'll use later. We'll go ahead and grab ourselves a warehouse out here. And I think I have a stamp. No, I don't have a stamp in the new world for timber production. That's okay. I can make do. Thinking three will be a good way, a good place to start with it. All right, that'll work. All right, let's go ahead and pop down jungle trees around them so they'll instantly start producing some timber for us here. Drop all that off, get us a little bit more. Yeah, let's go ahead and get some more housing placed in. Get some stuff unlocked. I would like to go ahead and at least get up through the Obrero phase in this episode. Uh, we'll see if I can do that rather quickly. Something I just realized I forgot to do. So I think I forgot to bring the Mole Master down. Let's jump over here and grab that. What brings you in, Master? Yeah, start producing those weapons now. Good deal. That's what I needed. Uh, items. Yeah, there's the Mole Master. I want him. I'm not going to bring down a Ferris El Cerami. So Mole Master is going to be useful here in just a little while. When we start making tortillas. And, you know, while I was down here, I meant to look... Okay, you're 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 actually close. Come on back down. There is an item I want to look for. Um, I don't think I can get it from the grand gallery. Can I? Hold on one second. Okay, no. Brain, my brain is so just not working right now. My brain is not working right now, so I have to I have to just constantly apologize. I I feel so terrible at the moment. But I promised you guys a video today, or you know, when you're watching this video, it's today technically, I guess, for you. I promised a video. Let's just leave it at that. I said I would try to do things, trying to do things, and not let the uh, the plague of Nurgle here kill me because it is it's killing me all right there's that unlocked okay go ahead and get rum going as well grab that we will need some timber over here for them I am not a jellyfish. Thank you very much. Let's just do this for a moment. Kind of like the plantations around it, you know? We'll go ahead and give them rum. That way they can produce that on their own. All right. Uh, all right, let me go try to find the item I am looking for real quick.
Okay, not finding it. When I find the item, I will uh, tell you why I got it and what it is about. But I don't want to spend all of my money right now. So I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, I'm going to leave you down here, though. I am going to leave you down. So stay there, please. Okay. Time to get the rest of this island going. Need more people to uh, get the last part. Time for ponchos. Get our poncho garner, I think, up here. Actually, no, take that back. We're going to get the poncho garner over here. Grab our alpaca farm. There we go. Okay, poncho garner up and running. Let's just keep expanding good old Manola here. Fun fact, I've never really expanded Manola and like built a full city on it um yeah I kind of lost my interest in the game around the time New World Rising came out uh Empire of the Skies kind of killed it for me so I I kind of just quit about that time and I have never really built a full city on Manola so I am looking forward to it now do we want to do sales here you know what I might as well I might as well do sales on this island as uh, two. So let's make that happen. Put that there. Then as far as the cotton plantations. Whoops. I have no idea what I'm doing with this, by the way. I'm I'm testing things. Ooh, hey, we're you're out of timber. Hi. That's not good. Uh, come here, lady. And she doesn't sell timber, of course. So what I think I'll do is pop up here. Oh no, can't, because my clipper is down. Yeah, clipper's coming in over here. So we'll swap. Let's send you back up home to Crown Falls to get some more timber. Okay. The land has to be this might be interesting looking. It's something. Okay, cool. There we go. All right, so we've got some sales going around here. I'll go ahead and set those to a minimum stock. Oh, not minimum stock. Uh, sell one above, we'll just say 40 for this place. That shall do. I do want a little extra storage already. Get our chapel online. I really wish I brought some timber here with our ship that's bringing the mole master. I didn't even think about that. That's okay. Okay. And a police station. Uh, you know what? I'm going to move. Let's move you to there. Put the police station there. That'll do. You know what? Let's change this up a little bit. For some reason, I think the skin right here for the old fire station looks better. At least in my opinion, I think it looks better with the um, this area, whatever this area is called. You know, this, this place and stuff. This place and stuff looks better like this. Oh, good God. I'm so sorry about that. My phone started ringing. Okay, respond to that. Be like, can't talk, doing things. All right, let's speed things up now. All right, there's Mole Master, and then you can just stay here, I guess. Cool. All right, lifestyle needs. What do they want? They want work clothes. They'll need felt, teff, soccer balls, beach, cinemas, of course, mail. 
All right, let's go ahead and get our obreros online now. That quest. Oh, we gotta go. Is this the llama one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go away. You're not too important to help an old man. Is that the llamas? Yeah, it's the llama one. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. What you gonna give me? A brick maker? Not really that great. Come on. Take that and go sell it. Let's just go sell that off. Okay. I'm also going to bring back some bricks. I need more brick. All right. Obrero is up and running now. Could use a trade union. Need 25 timber. I need a lot of timber right now because I need to get that going. I need to get bricks going. I need to get tortillas online. Let's go ahead and get the uh, tortillas online. Actually, no, I need the 25. So I can make a trade union. All right, going to skip ahead real quick while I just wait for some resources to come in. So be back in a second. Okay, so we've got that online. Uh, got our trade union down with the mole master in it and our tortilla maker down. So now he just needs fish oil and corn. So a lot better now he does increase productivity by 30 percent so our corn farms are going to have to produce a little bit more than normal we need and uh we'll need at least two at well need at least one extra uh fish oil factory or increase productivity to compensate for the added um output which i think we're just going to adjust the working conditions by 30% to adjust for that. If we take a look right here, that should, yeah, gets us gets us a little extra boost right there from that. All gravy. Uh, the only problem is, is I, oh, no, I have corn right there. Oh, boy. Maybe I should not have played today because brain no worky worky. Brain no worky worky today. All right, let's see. Oh. I want to go up here and do the corn up over this way. There's a nice square. Or rather, that's a rectangle, actually, isn't it? It's a, it's a shape that does vaguely what I want it to. There we go. That'll do. I'll move. I'll probably have to move that warehouse later. But so for corn, yeah, that's going to be a little shy on it. So instead of more people, we'll just increase that productivity to match. So another thirty percent on the corn, and now we're making enough. Cool. Perfect. Um, let's see. What did I want to double check? Consumer goods. Uh, all right. Yeah, we are underproducing several things now we need some more fried plantains we need some more ponchos so let's get all of that up and running now oh huh, interesting apparently i didn't have that covered another one of those now, for the poncho darner, I'm actually going to add in... Well, I'm not going to add in a silo yet because I can't do it. But we will. We'll add in a silo here in just a minute. Go ahead and preemptively slap down another corn farm. Right there. Make sure I had it in there. Good deal. Grab us another poncho darner somewhere. That'll do. Let's see if he's back over here yet. Yep, he is right there. He's almost there. Uh, by the way, some people have mentioned that they saw a version of uh, a Crown Falls in the old world that looked pretty cool because it actually had Crown Falls down here. And then I think there's another one with it over here. 
Uh, really good options as well. I think they're on mod.io. I don't know the names of them, but they do put Crown Falls in the bottom corners. Gets a lot better access to the new world. This down here would actually be like an amazing spot for Crown Falls because it's quicker access to both the new world and to Land of Lions to Mbessa right here. Uh, further from the Arctic, but that's not a big deal. So a couple other options that you could check out uh, over on mod.io uh, for some different locations for Crown Falls in the old world, since this particular custom version is not available to you guys. All right, almost ready. There it is. All right, get that up and running. That will double the output of our alpaca farm. So I can supply our double poncho darners. Sweet. And that takes care of quite a bit of that. Nice little lovely farming town right there. Loves it. Absolutely loves it. I'm not going to work on a hacienda right now. Haciendas are really not as amazing as they sound. Uh, they are really good for your uh, farms, obviously. Instead of, uh, you know big 168 tile farms you only have to have 60 tiles uh much better on the space usage for the farms but i'm just i'm you know I'm not really worried about space right now probably going to do the hacienda possibly down over in this area is what i'm thinking might might do it over here might do it over here don't know yet but we will use the hacienda for farming and stuff the housing on hacienda i get this question all the time is the housing for hacienda is worth it and uh, unfortunately that answer is a big fat no it is not worth it at all all right come on guy get you up here uh you know what actually i take that back come down here we can just we got plenty of cash i mean i've got seven hundred and twenty-five thousand coins we'll just come and buy uh, some timber and bricks down here. This is progress, at least. Of course, I've, I'm filled up on all of those goods up here right now. As you can see, still don't have a steelworks. Still am not building steelworks. And I've got all the steel I need for right now. All right, there's a hundred of each. That will do it. You know what? Do you have... Oh, stop, 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 stop. I'd like to see if I can get, yeah, there we go, Latin sales. That's a really good uh, early, uh, early, fairly cheap item. Only 75,000, 25% cargo slowdown uh, modifier and 10% movement speed. So that's going to help us get where we need to go a little bit faster. Speaking of which, 30 minutes left on her and an hour and a half left on him. So that's lovely. All right, it is now time to get our clay online. We do need some more obreros now. And they are upset because the ponchos, eh, that'll level itself out here in a second. We'll get some more obreros going. Probably should also go and grab some more islands. Um, not that button, this button. So I do need to spend a total of 300 influence. We have 109 currently invested. So I need, what is that? 291? Is that math? 291 more influence. So no, 191. Yeah, a 191. I'm sure someone already corrected me. I, I can't do math right now, guys. So I do need some more influence invested. We'll get there. Not a big deal. Uh, I would like at least to get up to this part right here. So I only need uh, 41 more influence invested on that. That's not too shabby. Let's go grab that. Give me another clipper. Uh, just go ahead and grab. No, oh, not that. Just grab that and that. And we'll go ahead and grab a couple of islands nearby that's got... What are we what are we lacking over here? Zinc and copper and maybe some iron. Uh this island up here looks like it would be decent. There's a good one. Yeah, there's a few decent islands we could grab. That would go ahead and at least get us the next milestone. There we go. 
give us some more free workforce. We do love our free workforce around here. There we go. All right, plenty of obreros. Um, yeah, I don't. I do know how to do the airships. Thank you so much, though. A delivery quest for sixteen tons of weapons. Ah, uh, you know what? Why not? Let's get the flagship to bring that down. Go here and grab a couple of islands just to uh, boost that up. Oh, come on now. Thank you. 35. Just one more little... Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. One more smaller island. I don't really need a ton going on right now. Sometimes there's nice little islands that are covered in lots of resources. This right here has got a lot of coal and copper on it. I will need a lot of zinc. Here, this little island right here would do. It's got a lot of zinc on it. Well, I say a lot. It's got two zinc. No, it's better. I do have to watch my influence because we are playing on low influence right now. Yeah, we'll go grab that one. Uh, you grab me some weapons. 20 weapons will do. We will uh, take those over to Manoa. Of course, that took away from that. I'm probably going to build a, few, a couple of ship of the lines. You know, they are some of the more powerful ships in the game. So might as well build those. Ah, you. Yes. Sell that, please. Um, I'm going to go ahead and buy all of this. Yeah. Let's just buy all of it. We're buying all of that because then I can go through and uh, go ahead and start placing post boxes. Uh, post boxes and mail and local mail get those things up and running for our people. And that's going to give us more coins and more uh, obreros and orleneros. We'll take all those to the old world as well and get those set up. So that's going to help us out tremendously. Let's go get our second brick factory online here. All right, lovely. And that should have given us enough time for him to get right there. Another 32, that will work. And you're happy. That gave us an extra 50 on our workforce. Perfect. There is Unifier. Awesome. So 100 extra. So now we have plus 100 workforce everywhere. Oh, good. You're here. All right. Lovely. So there's all the bricks that we could possibly need at the moment. And if I double check this right here, we are still good. Getting a little close on the fried plantains, the rum. Still good on the tortillas, though, so not worried about that. Uh, boxing arena is needed by our people, so we'll go ahead and get that put in behind the police station. And now we are mostly just waiting on... What do we have the need for next? Oh, coffee. Lovely, lovely coffee. Um, we're going to start the coffee production. Hmm. Thinking, 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 thinking. Hold on one second. Let me look at something. Yeah, so I think I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and start the Hacienda. Reason being is because... The uh, everybody knows coffee is just one of those things that takes it takes so much coffee, <laughs> so much coffee, and the hacienda uh, is just going to be the better option for production of coffee with the uh, hacienda farm. Yeah, I know. So we're going to go ahead and just do it. Just going to go ahead and do it. Uh, nice big radius already. Is this really going to be the best place for it though? Or maybe. I don't really want to put it up there. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to have, like, this is my only hacienda uh, in the entire region, so it doesn't have to be perfect. This will work. This will work. 
We'll just go with it here. Uh, okay, farm. Crop selection. Grab that coffee. 64 tiles. I said 60. I know. I'm I'm terrible. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I said 60. It's 64 tiles. Whatever. It's not the end of the world. Alright, cool. Figure out how I want to place this thing, though. Struggles of trying to make it square. How did I do that? I can never figure out how I do things. I'm like, how did I do that and make it, like, there? It's not perfect, but it'll work. So, whatever. Uh, okay, coffee brewery over here with this. Get that coffee started. So, yep, yeah, we're good on there. Sweet. Let's see. We'll drop off 50 there. Should be more than enough. And now we're going to send the rest of it up there. There's that. Send you back onto Crown Falls. Yep. Yeah. Uh, import tax. Uh, pretty terrible. Pretty terrible. Okay, so that takes care of those needs right there. Out of curiosity, though, let's double check how many I need to make coffee productive. So the two, so that's uh, fifty each. And I'm busy right now, Isabel. So there's 50, so I mean, 25 each, that's 50, so that's 200. Costs 200 to maintain that thing. And we are making a whopping two coins from it. A whopping two coins. So, you know, math, and yes, you can hear my calculator in the background. Uh, I need 100 obreros to make coffee uh, viable. And I currently only have 28 obrero homes. So, that that means is we need to do some major upgrading and major expansion of the city to cover the cost of the, um, the, the, the doohickey right here, the coffee. That gets, that gets us up to 44, but we do need to do some more expansion now, so let's go ahead and do that. somehow by the grace of god that worked out perfectly right there i don't know how that worked but it worked i can never do that i think i'm just gonna go ahead and do i have a little bit i have a little bit to cover until i have it upgraded i am gonna go ahead and grab this hospital though uh the people once that's unlocked i feel like they start getting sick like instantaneously so I'm going to go ahead and get a hospital built in preparation. I'll put you back there because that looked kind of cool. Awesome. We do have some different skins for this. Um, Summer Market, Summer Market Plaza. Let's go, let's go with the Summer Market Plaza. How about, there we go. That's a nice looking little market right there. Very bright and colorful. It'll match the Artistas really good here in a little while. Okay. What does that give us to? 62. Making 20... Making quite a bit of money now. Let's go ahead and see how we're doing now. Okay, so now we're, we are really underproducing quite a bit of stuff at the moment. So let's go ahead and catch back up on everything. Or 
do I want to do this instead? Oh, not that. I want that. This. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and get our first bit of mail stuff going. We don't have a ton of room, so I'm actually just going to use post boxes for a lot of this. Let's see. Did not leave myself very good room for that. I may have to actually go ahead and you know what I am. Let's uh let's move some stuff around here. Oh gosh, that's right. It's a it's a funny sized building. Oh, I hate that. It's a it's just a weird it's just a weird building size, you know. All right, hold on. We'll make this work. I will make this work. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I shut Paloma. I am super duper busy. Do something like that. I mean, that's super ugly. I mean, that is super ugly. I don't like that at all. That's just a weird thing of buildings. I do not like that. Ugh. I'll, I will have to fix that here in a little while because I can't deal with that. Uh, but I'm not going to make y'all sit here and watch me do it. Alright, let's unlock their need for local mail. It's going to get us some more people in here. And while that's happening, let's expand production of stuff. Because we are in need of more goods now. Um, We're going to come over here and expand our rum production. Get us another warehouse right there. That shall do. Region shaken up by the Artistas. Even though I can't technically upgrade to Artistas yet. So, you know, lie to me more. <laughs> Grab that. Grab another plantain. Uh-oh. Where? Way out there? Really? Oh, fine. Here. Have have a police station out there. Just just leave me alone. I'm busy. Alright. Uh it's time for you to actually get like, you know, somewhere else. There's a kitty cat. You may have just heard my cat start hollering. She's hollering at me because I am not paying attention to her. Because I'm working. Okay, let's see. Alright, what else were we short of? We were short ponchos. Yeah, we were short ponchos a little bit. So, time for another poncho garner. And we will need another alpaca farm. One, two, three, four. Okay, cool. Fine. Drop off that timber right there. So that should catch us up on everything. Yep, good. See, see how easy that is? I So many people are always like, it's so difficult to try to keep up with, you know, expanding production. It's, it's not. Once you expand a bit and then just hit that, you know, go to the statistics screen, control Q on the PC. No clue what it is on the console. But just, you know, get into the statistics screen, see what you're short of, build a chain, until it's supplied. It's uh it is that easy. Kitty cat, you're banging on my table. <laughs> she's she's very upset with me right now because I am not paying attention to her. Hi. Alright, 70 Abrero homes. Good deal. Good, good deal. Uh we have unlocked beer and cigars for them now. They do want spectacles, typewriters, illuminated scripts, all that good stuff. 
but we are fine with all that. Let's get the bombins going. You cannot come up in my lap, pumpkin. I'm sorry, guys. My, my cat is just like crawling to get into my lap. She, she's just... She really wants to be like right next to me right now. I was gone all week on a trip to uh, Arizona to the Grand Canyon. And she is absolutely beside herself that I am home. And she will not leave me alone. Like, ever since I got home, she has just been attached to me ever since I walked in the door and she saw that I was home. She's just been attached to my hip. And I do love her. I love my kitty. But right now I am trying to get stuff done. It is not kitty time. Okay, anyways, uh, rambling again. I know. Uh, let's see what we're doing here. Oh. Got a couple of houses right there and one right there. That'll work. Um, so that is our felt. We will need some cotton. So let's grab another cotton mill and then let's just grab two plain. Let's just grab this whole kind of setup again. How about that? And what I will do, I, I'm sorry guys if you're hearing the banging around. I can't. I, I, I give up, basically. I, I essentially I give up. I give in to the power of cat doing what she wants. There we go. Okay. Alright, so that's going to give us everything that we need for the uh, bomb and weaver to supply us. Good deal. Good, good deal. How are we doing on time? So two minutes. Need to keep an eye on that because that will go by very quickly. Get those bombins supplied. Again, it's not a lot of money. We don't make much money around here. Could give them some beer. And actually, it's probably not the worst idea. Uh, and to supply them beer, there's actually an item I want to find. I think she sells it. Doesn't she sell it? Uh, it, the item, it's the item I was looking for earlier, and it is Gordon the Master Grocer. And I'm pretty sure, oh no, only Eli sells it. I'm sorry, never mind. Uh, Gordon the Master Grocer, yeah, forgot, Eli sells that one. Uh, supplies beer, basically. It supplies beer and gives happiness to people within the radius, so really, really awesome specialist right there. We're going to uh, pop back over to the old world here, if I can remember what this place is called. And let's just jump over to Eli for a second and see if we can't find at least one Gordon the Master Grocer. That way I can supply beer to our people up here. Uh, we will need a town hall for that. Of course, it's probably going to go right there where I have all this ugly mess going on. I got to fix this. Hold on. Okay, I have spent a bit of money. I still have not found a Gordon the Master Grocer yet over here at Eli. Uh, over here at Eli. However, I did find a Dario, which he cost you know about three. He cost three hundred thirty-three thousand. So that was a big chunk of cash right there. However, he's going to be very useful uh, because I will be able to use him to change up my sewing machines and stuff. He affects sewing machines and bicycle factories. So we're going to slot him in. So now instead of steel, it will just require iron, which will let me get rid of my furnaces right here, which is going to be very, very nice. Let's get rid of that. And then we'll be able to uh, also sell off pocket watches and, um, you know, things. So pocket watches and gramophones. It's really slow. He won't produce them often, but we will be able to uh, produce those a little excess and sell those goods right there. So that'll be kind of handy. Uh, so no Dario, oh no, no Dario, uh, no Gordon right now, so no beer, but it's okay. I'm not really worried about it too much. Bombins, what's what's the deal with bombins? We're making enough bombins, just barely. We're making enough of everything else. Fish oil is a little bit shy. Let's just go ahead and boost fish oil all the way up to 50%. That takes care of it. Everything else looks good. All right. Wood is a little low. Again, 
instead of building a whole other one, I'm just going to increase that productivity slightly. Just ever so slightly to get that boosted up and we are good to go again. Awesome. Not too shabby. So the last thing we'll have to have is sewing machines. Now, if we take a look between here and Crown Falls, uh, we are not producing enough sewing machines at the moment to supply that. However, hold on. How many do we, how many did I need per minute? I don't need many. I need two per minute. That is it. So what I could do is buy those from Archie. Oh my gosh, he's selling a ship of the line? For serious? Yeah, give me that. <laughs> give me. Give me the ship of the line. If you're going to sell me a ship of the line, I will take a ship of the line. No questions asked there. Um, a smuggling quest? I don't really feel like dealing with those. Yeah, I just really don't feel like dealing with that. So that gives me a frigate, the flagship, and a ship of the line up here for my fleet. So that's going to be handy. Uh, anyways, what I was saying was I could go ahead and just buy sewing machines from Eli um, on an Eli Archie, but it is super expensive compared to what it would cost to produce them myself and just boost the output a little bit. Since we are also going to, uh, we're about to be able to produce them without, uh, without him affecting it. Let's... Go ahead and already move our weapons production over to here. We'll grab ourselves another sewing machine factory. Giant, probably a very loud bang right there as Cat decided to jump off the desk and make all the racket. Oh, kitty cats. I love them, but they're noisy. Okay, where is he at? There he is. Oh, no, that's a pirate. That's a pirate. Hop up here, drop off Dario and these aluminum profiles. Cool. All right, let's slot Dario in now. Now we only need iron, so I can get rid of that. If we take a look right here. Uh, yeah, we are way producing now. Uh, actually, yeah, we're way producing just from one furnace. And I think actually what I could do now is take that out because I don't need it. And I could take out the coal because I have coal being boosted to 50%. Saves on some happiness. So yeah, we are perfect now. We are absolutely perfect. Everything is good. We are being, uh, we're producing sewing machines excess now. So now I should be making enough sewing machines to, to take care of that. Perfect. I want you to head back to Manola. But I'm going to go down here to Manola now and grab the Endeavor because it does have the uh, cargo slowdown. There was another item that popped up earlier that I did not buy that I kind of wish I did at Eli. And I'm going to look for a couple of him later. And it, that's the port dealer. I'll show you him real fast here. Here he is right there. The port dealer is a really good early game item if you have the money to buy him. He costs, he costs 94300 and he reduces cargo slowdown by 60%. Really, really good early game item right there. If you can find a few of him at Eli. Other than that, a Latine sale is not bad. 25% slowdown isn't terrible. So let's go ahead and start this trade route. So we're going to go from Crown Falls down to Manoa. And I'm just going to tell, he's just going to be a one trick pony for right now. Create a new route, or create a new group, rather. This is um, Old World, New World, Main. So these are going to be like for my main islands. That's my main islands being uh, anything that is supporting from the Old World to the New World, um, like to Manola, basically. That's how I'm going to group. I, well, that's that's what the category should be. Sewing machines. And then the group. 
is old world, new world. There, perfect. Okay. So now let's pop back up here for right now. Grab that. Grab this. Uh, minimum stock of, right now we're going to say 75. That should be good. Lovely. And I think we also, do I have, am I producing enough to justify selling them? I am. So let's also set a um, minimum stock right here of 50. And then we're going to take the uh, rum trade route. We're going to tell it to load up and sell those. And that's going to start making me a bunch of cash right there as well. So that's going to help with our money situation even further. So that's going to be really, really handy. I think it's too expensive, but it's okay. It is okay. As long as my cash is good, then as long as my balance is not too terrible. So I'm going to uh, let the game catch up real quick. Get those whatever I just unlocked apparently down here. Oh, I unlocked some of the like chocolate and stuff. Okay. I'm going to let those sewing machines get filled in and then I will see you when we get back. All right, so we have got these sewing machines fulfilled now for these guys. They are ready to be upgraded to Artistas. Uh, I did do a little bit of work, though, back in the old world, just briefly. Uh, shuffled a few things around, got ourselves a post office, and I slapped down a post box. There it is, a, a post box down here as well uh, to start generating mail. So we do have local mail turned on for all of our people now artisans engineers uh workers and farmers they have all of that turned on to them and i did i expanded our population down here just a touch more uh, upgraded some more we had a we have a huge excess of farmer workforce put them up into workers i'll move those up into artisans and so on here later on and then I uh, I increased working conditions on everything because it's like I just needed, you know, I didn't need like a full production chain. I just needed a little extra. So for right now, this right here will work. Uh, once I need more, I will go ahead and build another chain and then take away the working conditions just to kind of level things out a little bit. And it won't be so, so harsh on me. Uh, but yeah, so mail is being supplied everywhere. We've got all that taken care of. Uh, we've got sewing machines being supplied, the, uh, whatchamacallits, you know, those things with the, uh, the, the fur coats that I sold 50 fur coats to Madame Kahina and that brought me in 49,000 coins. So that is helping tremendously. One thing I do need to do before I forget is to go ahead and set those gramophones and pocket watches. Uh, we're going to sell these guys right here when it's just, let's just say a Hell, it's just above like 10. We're not going to need these for a while. Gramophones and pocket watches sell just, let's just say, yeah, above 10. That'll work. So that right there will bring in some extra cash for us. Oh, that's right. We're making bombins and I forgot we're making these things right here. Let's also sell these things. I don't need these. So everything above 10 on those as well. Yeah, because we're getting those from him. Uh, but it's every 12, so again, really slow, not very quick on the production on those, but, you know, it's a little something. It helps a little bit. Apparently, we have no no chance of riots on our island. That's, that's a surprise. I feel like that's broken. I feel like we should have some riot chances on our islands because we have so many working conditions. Uh, but then again, our people are very happy. Now, the farmers are not super happy. They're only at plus six, but they're just farmers. Who really cares, you know? I mean, let's just be honest with ourselves here. Who cares if the farmers are unhappy? I sure don't. Uh, so, yeah. All of that looks good to me. Let's pop back over to Manola. And we'll go ahead and get our first Artistas. Boom. The Age of Festivals. Yes, Artistas away. Artistas are here. We can produce sewing machines if we want to down here. Probably not going to. Uh, we can make our... Yeah, I, I know how you work, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It wants a thousand artistas. Uh, so we're going to be able to make soccer balls, mezcal, which is, you know, tequila, 
So we got lots of stuff to be made here in the future for our Artistas, but I think we're going to take a break from the New World now that we have it all set up and running in roughly one hour total of recording time. Um, I don't pause the recording. I do go back and just cut out. That way I can see how long I've been playing. So in one hour, we have the... We're already up to Artistas in an hour, and that was kind of slow. Probably could have done that in like 30, like maybe 30 minutes if I was really actually trying to do it because it's really easy to supply these guys it's not difficult at all so yeah there we go artistas are up and running uh we are going to say goodbye to the new world for just a little while though and get back focusing over on the old world i do want to go ahead and expand out the city tremendously in the next episode i want to get the uh the main layout for it going i want to get uh i want to get my vision for how i want the city to start coming together and start expanding our population of all of our peoples so with that guys thank you so so much for joining me i hope to see you in the next video and until then take care